Greetings, Hope Church. It's a blessing to be with you today. I just want to start this week's worship, online worship, out with a few announcements about what's happening back at church. And this really is an exciting time as we look forward to Holy Week, which we didn't get to really celebrate last year because of the pandemic. I just want to give some brief updates as to when and how we as a church will be worshiping. So we're going to have our Good Friday service, and there are two times in the evening for that. And then on Easter Sunday, we're going to have three services all that information is on your screen now, and it will be on the church website. Uh, if you want to register via the website or the app, we would love to see you uh, come back for Easter. And, and this is a, a note, especially to our senior saints. There, there's been some question, now that seniors are getting vaccinated, they want to come back to church, but there's some questions about the parking lot and the valet service and getting in safely to the building. I just want to say, uh, as of last su Sunday, we relaunched our valet parking for anyone that needs help getting into the building or need, needs help getting their car parked. Uh, so if, if that is you, please come back. We would love to serve you in that way. And one other thing uh, uh, concerning moving forward in ministry after Easter, uh, the, the Sunday after Easter, April 11th, we are launching our Growth Hour ministry. So as we've switched our schedule around on sun Sunday morning where there's First service, sandwich, growth hour, second service. The growth hour is where we are going to practice being a catechizing church together. And that looks like a word and world classes for the adults. All that information is online on the Revelation class and the Witness to the World class. But I also really want to plug the fact that this is for everyone. And with that, there's middle school, high school, elementary school, and even pre-K Sunday school. It's all being implemented. It's all launching on April 11th. So there's plenty of space to register your family for those uh, ministry events, and this is just a cool opportunity. In two hours on a Sunday morning, you can, corporate, you can participate in corporate worship with the body and also have some instruction and catechism through the growth hour. So we really hope you would consider joining us. But with that, we're, we're excited for this season. We understand if you still need to be home. We love you, we, we miss you, and we are excited for when you can return safely to be a part of our worship service. But as we continue this online virtual uh, worship service for this Sunday, would you join me in a word of prayer? Father, we thank you for your grace, your mercy, all the good gifts that you give us. Even, even as we reflect on the kind of the one-year anniversary of when the pandemic really started to affect us and shut everything down, we are so thankful that you've sustained your church, that you've grown us, that you've taught us so many things. Lord, that there's just, you use all things for your glory, for your kingdom purposes, and for our discipleship. So we thank you for this opportunity to worship this morning uh, through singing, through giving, through sitting under your word. We pray that you would be glorified in all that we do, helping us be formed around the gospel and the gospel message. Speak to our hearts on what it looks like to be the church in this season as so many people in our community and our world around us are without hope and in need of you. So even as this COVID continues and there's so many questions still remaining, just give us wisdom, give us guidance Help us be sent out into the world, whatever that may look like, all for your glory and all for your kingdom purposes. And Father, as we worship you right now in this moment, we pray that you would be exalted, that the majesty, the worth, the work of your Son would be put on display, that your Spirit would work greatly to instruct, to correct, to transform us all for your glory. We pray this in King Jesus' name. Amen.